First alert update tonight about the former school resource officer now facing charges of bestiality in Fond du Lac County. This case comes just days after prosecutors charged Stephen Rosales for sexting with a student in Washington County. Rosales already posted a $40,000 cash bond in that case where he faces three felonies, including sexual misconduct by school staff. Today, he received a $100,000 cash bond in Fond du Lac County for five felonies involving bestiality. Brittany Schmidt gives us the latest details on this case and a first alert update. Brittany. Cammie and Bill, we are choosing not to report on several graphic details in this complaint due to the nature of the charges. In fact, in court this morning, both parties waived a reading of the complaint. But I will tell you, Rosales is accused of having sexual contact with his dog on multiple occasions between 2020 and earlier this year. In the criminal complaint, investigators uncovered several graphic text messages where Rosales describes various acts. Fond du Lac County District Attorney Eric Tony says Rosales doesn't have a criminal history, but he does have an open case in Washington County from just last week. We first alerted you to those felony charges last night, where the former Kewaskum School Resource Officer is accused of sexting a student. Investigators report finding more than 9,000 messages exchanged between the two in just three months, many of them sexually explicit. Those messages led to the discovery of other graphic messages regarding bestiality. Tony says these cases are rare and the investigation is ongoing. I'm not going to comment on anything we, we may do in that regard. It's fair to say with cases in general, investigations are always ongoing. Uh, just because somebody may be arrested or charged doesn't mean law enforcement stops an investigation. There are times where folks come forward with, with more evidence or information and certainly be the same in this circumstance. If anybody has any additional information that they believe law enforcement may not know or should be aware of, we would encourage them to reach out. Today in court, Rosales' defense attorney tried arguing for a lower bond, saying his client is not a flight risk and his family needs him. Rosales told investigators he, quote, has been under a lot of stress lately at home due to his wife's high-risk pregnancy. Rosales is due back in court next month. Cammie Bill.